Hey everyone, Moxie here. As you know, you can play as the Arachnite costume in Spider-Man 2 for the PS5, and the Arachnite being an amalgamation between uh, Peter Parker and Moon Knight in the Warp World comic series. But if you want to look closer to Moon Knight, this is how you're going to do it. You definitely want a nighttime save file. Um, or if you're playing uh, through the game, make sure it's nighttime. It's going to look the best. Uh, I have save files left over from the Mysterium kind of glitch. Uh, and, uh, of course, daytime and nighttime and weather should be patched in shortly. So stay tuned, and I'm going to show you how to do this. First off, doesn't matter what costume you start with. I've got the Amazing Spider-Man 2 here, so we're going to swap that out for the Arachnite costume. So let's do that and just go down and select the white version of the Arachnite costume. Now from there, what you want to do is you're going to go into your settings and you're going to go down and you're going to go up into the visual and go all, you start from the bottom and go up and you're going to go into your hero shader. Now if you select white, this is what it's going to look like. Not very Moon knight issue. So you definitely don't want to select white in this. So you think, well, geez, what am I going to select? Well, go back, go back to it, go into the hero shader. You got to go through the visual again, and you're going to go up there and you're going to select black as your color. And when you select black, you're going to have a little more detail. So here's what it looks like. You've got the costume and it kind of shines in the darkness. And now you've got a perfect looking Moon Knight costume for you to enjoy. As mentioned, I have a rain save, so if you're looking for something that's a little more Spider-Man Noir, what you want to do is you want to go into uh, a rainy day uh, save, and then you're going to go back into the settings, and you're going to switch that over to visual as well. And uh, my contrast and my uh, brightness are set at 55 each. Uh, you can play with that a little bit, but what you want to go down to in the visual is the uh, high contrast background, and you're going to turn that on. And it's going to give, of course, you're going to be black in your costume uh, on your shader and the high contrast background. It's going to be set to on and it's going to give you a grayscale city. When you go into that, the city will be darker and you'll have more of that, um, you know, moon and costume will be black, darker. But hey, there is a dark side of the moon, right? Some moron in a truck hit me when I was crossing the street last Saturday. So I've been laid up until now. Last Saturday? You mean, during the snowstorm? Yeah. Said he didn't see me. What'd you expect? You're wearing all white in the middle of a snowstorm. Give your head a shake, numbnuts. Why do you always wear white, anyway? There is a dark side of the moon, you know. Wow. I literally never thought of that. That's not bad. I could dress in all black. That will possibly decrease the instances of where I'm spotted in the shadows by give or take. Like I'm thinking 100%. At least. There is <laughs>